Hi everybody, it's uh, T2 here at Boston Paintball. I wanted to show you guys a really neat gun that came across uh, my desk. It's uh, in for uh, tuning from a customer. Uh, it's heading out today, but before I sent it out, I really wanted to show you guys this. Um, so any more old school fanatics might recognize this gun. This is a Boston Paintball Reflex Autococker. This gun was produced in very low numbers in the late 90s. It was immediately banned from all tournament series due to how some people have said how awesome it is. Uh, it is the grandfather in the first gun to have a response trigger built into it. So if you can see this airline right here, anybody that has a Tipman will recognize that. This airline goes into an on-off system so you can deactivate the response. It also has this little rammer, this activator rammer right here with the two-way valve. So just like a standard auto cocker. You should pull the trigger. Come we'll shoot. But once you flip this switch right here it will then feed this piston behind the trigger. All pneumatic, all air driven. And as you can imagine, back in the late 90s when this came out, uh, nothing was touching it. If you actually notice the back one comes a lot further back off the gun than a standard auto cocker, and that was actually for the delay of the loader because it was nothing fast enough that could feed it back then. Um, all in all, a great piece of history, and I'm glad I could show you guys this before it went back to its, uh, its home. Um, all right, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye-bye.